All right, folks, welcome back. It's the losers match now for the group, and what's sad about this is I mean someone's about to be knocked out. Uh, we'll see whom it's going to be or who. I actually don't know which one to use there, but uh, spawning in the bottom right corner of the map from Startail, it's the green Terran player alive. And on the opposite side, 11 o'clock position, Fox Red, Red Zerg, Rocket Sun. So yeah, we didn't get to go to this uh, too much last time, but for those who haven't seen this before, we were trying to figure out for a long time what Rocket's logo was. Was it like a panther, a jaguar, a tiger, it's, or it's whatever? It's a panther, jaguar thing. It's not a no, grizzly bear. No, it's definitely a no, bear it's... because we ran a straw no, poll, James, with over 100 people voting bear over the other three options. So because quite that clearly... that was probably the most, the least likely So answer. James, quite clearly, it's your vision and our vision that's incorrect, as this is very clearly a bear, or obviously 100 plus people would not have voted bear. Hey, hey, listen here. I have four eyes, and I'm Asian. I squint, and everything looks a lot clearer so when you, you squint. So two eyes? What? <laughs> I think you have two eyes and glasses, friend. Hey, four eyes four is like eyes. a derogatory yeah. term used by elementary schoolers to yeah, make fun of folks geez. with glasses. <laughs> I think you should take a moment to reconsider where you are in your life right now, James, and perhaps seek some professional help. <laughs> because clearly, true. you can't see bears. <laughs> Oh my god, it is not bear. <laughs> okay, uh, getting on a more serious topic for this. A, I'm really cool and really glad that we didn't see that there was, or we didn't see a T-Rex out of this. I was really kind of worried, you know, it's Fox Rat Labs. Sometimes Saren players get a little bit antsy on this one. And it really depends on spawn locations. But I think specifically because this is the one with kind of crappy thirds, Alive's looking to play the more macro game for this. As Hyun is probably not going to have the best time in the world trying to secure either the base on the left or that gold. The other kind of cool thing, too, is uh, these are both fantastic players who, I, I gotta be honest, I kind of expected to see the winner's match, not the loser's match. So, a complete uh, flipped, flipped group reversal for there for me. Mm. Thoughts, James? Uh-huh. Yep, exactly. Good deal. Concur. That's what I thought. Yeah. Hey, this, this spawn lo location, um, <clears throat> a lot of players find that... Um, this is this looks better for the Terran than the other way around, because it's such a a wide um, wide entrance versus the tight chokes. Um, we could prob I was gonna say we could see a live go into three three barracks immediately after the or three commands and three immediately after the barracks, but no, no he goes pretty standard factory gas. Not that I'm bored of it or anything like that. I'm just saying. No. <laughs> Not that I'm bored or anything. <laughs> I don't think anyone was implying that you were, but now that you're getting over defensive about it, I can't help but think you must be bored. Uh, so don't let us keep you, James, if that's the case. But uh, The Reaper did live, and this is kind of a key point. Uh, Lings are patrolling over here to make sure it doesn't jump back up, but there's two queens on the front line. So he's not going to be able to do too much with this, but just like we see Terran versus anything, scouting information is going to be a pretty big deal. And one of the scariest things you want to look out for are roaches. Uh, if there's a guy who's willing to go roach bailing all in, it's certainly he on. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Roach but king. Oh, I didn't notice the live was picking up that racks, but that's exactly what he did. Um, yeah, extra measures to kill the overlord. He wanted to build a tech yeah. lab on that racks, but realized that the starport was going to finish by the time it landed. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of awkward. It's actually just more efficient to build the tech lab on the starport, but uh, go for a medevac instead. I don't know. Maybe the have maybe a lot to drop is the thing. I guess widow mines. Yeah, you can see widow mines. I can't mines. tell if this is a change build because that tech lab is so much later, or. He just is like, I'll save the money because I feel like he is going to get Tech Lab and Sim. It has to be because, like, why would you take that second gas so quickly otherwise, right? Yeah, that's true. Unless he puts, like, an armory with Widow Mines. Legit. Shut <laughs> armory up. with Widow Mines and two Hellions. <laughs> the sickest push you've ever seen. Two Hellbat 2, Widow Mine 1. <laughs> New timing, 2 2 1. It's legit. Don't worry about it. Uh, so he's actually just going to start up Stim and skip right past Banshees, and that's, I think that's perfectly fine. Whether it's an accident or on purpose, his timings would be screwed up for Banshee at this point anyways. No, he's definitely changed his mind multiple times um, throughout this game, because he, he made the tech lab with the barracks, but when the tech lab finished, he lifted the barracks, and then he landed again <laughs> for the Stim upgrades. I can't decide. I can't decide. No. It is kind of scary to find yourself being that indecisive, though, against a player like Hyun. Uh, I'm not saying Hyun's the end-all be-all for Zerg, he's certainly not, but it's still a really strong player, a really scary guy to make small mistakes against. I think the Widow Mines didn't really do a whole lot. 
Yeah, it's... Warm You're shade. saying? I don't know, I'll just say it wasn't over yet. Huh. Okay. Okay, buddy. Actually, I think Queen Divis is so bad, he actually could have lifted that up and walked away with it until the link's... Oh, the medevac was... No. Very, very low. No, no, I mean, like, unburrow the wind might just walk away. <laughs> oh, maybe, maybe. Links, there's actually a lot of links in the field right now. I think he was expecting a, uh, like a Hellbat push or something, because he also got a Bailey that's pretty well timed to defend yeah. one. So now he has 38 links and equal amount of workers. So alive is even like, okay, oh, okay, Bane buddy. Links. Three bunkers. Ooh, yeah. Lots of Bane links. This is not just uh, a lot of Bane links. There's a lot of Zerglings still coming up behind us. He's got drones at third base. Uh, I <gasps> forgot this is young. Like, he loves Put doing away. this. Naked Put thirds. Away. Put away. Up and not much of anything useful. Still, the Hellions should be able to deal with a good chunk of the Banelings if you saw this were coming, but Hyun is baiting him away with these small amounts of links. So here comes the Banelings. The depot's down. He's going to bust through this first bunker. There's two more available, and thank God there is, because otherwise the live would be completely screwed. Yeah, this isn't enough. Like, the Ling Flood would be able to deal with just the Marines, but the Hellions are still choke. alive. Yeah, especially with the choke in that small wall to have the Hellions sit on the other side of it. Uh, so for now, Alive will stay in this game, and Hyun finds himself behind. You know, he, he cut workers to make that happen. It was supposed to be a much bigger attack, but uh, Alive with some sick game sense stays alive. Oh, oh, da, 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 da. Okay, it's not that bad. I don't know why he didn't stay in that choke or go up on one of these little cliff ledges where there's like you just filter all the legs in, but. Uh, cutting around is only going to work so long. Speedlings are going to eventually get on top of these. Tries to go for this round yet again. Manages to squeeze out these Hellions. What are they made of? Grease. Grease, a butter, grease. oil. Yeah, all the all the above. Yeah, he still he's killing so many Hellions. Uh, he doesn't really have a lot of production. Oh, that's not a wall, buddy. Hey, they're alive. Uh, yeah, he doesn't really have any uh, marine production. The uh -oh. barracks are late. <laughs> this is actually a really big problem. Uh, there's, there's like. Uh, more bunkers coming down. That's good, I guess. Notice. But oh, I think he does notice. <laughs> the wood mines is gonna come back. You may be able to pick up a couple of bailing eggs while they morph. That's actually not a bad idea. But uh, this is Yun being quite relentless with his attacks, and it's 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 such uh. an investment out of him. I don't think it's gonna uh, end the game. And that's the problem. Micro. Yeah, it is the problem. Is that this has to end the game? Thirty-five drones. Um, the Ling flood again yeah. would probably have been better as there were no Hellions. But oh well. Dang, Yun. Goes for that all-in, doesn't cut it. That's the thing about the 